Hey family, this is Paula G. with your Quiet Storm Devotion. Today's devotion is entitled, Always Present. As we travel this journey called life, there will be many obstacles, there will be many pitfalls, there will be many detours. We may stumble, we may trip, and we may flat out fall. There will be times of sadness, times of weakness, times of suffering, times of pain. However, as you continue to travel on your journey, know and believe in your heart that God is there by your side each step of the way. He's there to give you strength. He's there to give you peace. He's there to give you wisdom and discernment. He's there to lead and guide you as you continue this journey called life. Now, there may be times of sickness or injury, but he is there to see you through. Just imagine traveling down this road and constantly having someone beside you to share the journey and to help you through the difficult times. He is that ever-present being. The Spirit of God lies deep within each of us and his still, small voice speaks to us but we often do not hear it due to the distractions of life. But it is comforting to know that when we choose to simply be still, when we choose to allow our mind, body, soul, and spirit to be still, we can hear his still, small voice. We also need to remember that while we are on this journey that we must have faith in each and every step that we take along the way. We must stay in the present moment with each step, not looking back or preoccupying our thoughts with what lies ahead, but being present in the moment of each step, for there are lessons to be learned in the moment. There are things to observe and see that may help us along our journey. And if our thoughts are consumed by what lies ahead or what we have left behind, if our focus is on what lies ahead and what we left behind, then we miss the power of the present and we may miss something that he is speaking to us or something that he is showing us that will help us along our journey. In a sense, we may miss a cue that could mean the difference between our journey taking us four days or 40 days to reach our destiny. And as you go throughout your day, remember to pause and listen to God's still small voice. For it is in that moment that he may be speaking the very pearl of wisdom and discernment that you need to hear for such a time. This is Paula G. Voice with your quiet storm devotion. Can you feel the power?